So I do appreciate everybody that you know gave me fed, fed, fed back, feedback uh, on this video, Let's Talk. And it was just a video that I wanted to upload and kind of talk to you guys and give you guys some insight into my thought process and you know where I'm at as far as you know YouTube goes mentally. You know um, because it's just I have my own personal stuff going on, but YouTube itself does have issues. You know with the infrastructure of the site as a whole, and also I've got my own personal issues with the platform and with the way people interact on the platform now I did say that you know I, I do appreciate all the support that I've got and I genuinely mean it like there was a lot of a lot of a lot of support and um, you know it means the world to me it really does so thank you I, I genuinely thank every one of you that left a comment on this video and if you haven't checked it out if you're new or whatever the case is feel free to check it out um, I won't be able to get back to you on it you know because you know the video is kind of just sitting here it's like a, a means to kind of listen to what I have to say. I'm going to do more videos like this, but just where I talk to you guys. Um, you know, but I did want to take this opportunity to record a video in which I basically will go ahead and look at the comments because it was overwhelming amount of feedback. Uh, 438 comments, as you see here, that's crazy. And, you know, I don't know how many of those are organic comments or if there's like conversations going on in threads like this here, like there's a couple comments here, but nonetheless, there's a lot and it really means the world to me, as I said. So I'm going to just take this opportunity. I'm sorry if I can't get back to everybody because I am on time constraints. I don't have a lot of times, uh, times, time to really do this, but I will try to get back to you guys. I love how YouTube is just like, oh, watch your own videos. Look at all these videos on the side of mine. Anyways. All right, so BLR, shout out to everybody in this video, by the way. Uh, BLR Notification Squad, thanks, bro. I appreciate it. I appreciate everybody having notifications on, especially now. If you haven't already, enable them because YouTube's having issues and it unsubscribes people. If you have the notification on, you'll still get my video uploaded. You'll notice that you're unsubscribed, though, and you can resubscribe, which is awesome. Um, so, yeah. Uh, BLR. I'm not going to really get into the thread comments, like the responses to these comments. I feel like D3 would knock a nigga out and not care one bit. <laughs> uh, it's, honestly, I would. I'm not going to lie. Uh, <clears throat> you're awesome. Thanks, bro. Long live Stelio. Excuse me if I, bu I um, butcher anybody's names in this. Please do a face reveal. I did so on the Gotenks video I uploaded last week. Um, and I, you know, I've done so so many times. Like, I don't understand the infatuation with seeing my face. Uh, Alex Buxala, excuse me. Hell yeah, man. If someone says fuck you, they deserve a fuck you. Exactly. Um, Big Green, of course. <laughs> Piccolo. Don't take no L's. Yeah, I don't take any L's. Uh, I'm like a month new. I like your content. I appreciate you, Anna. Thank you. I really do appreciate you. Uh, Typhlo Shinobi. Good God free. I will always... I will always together with you until the end of my life, dude. Be awesome. Ignore these dumbasses. Remember, dude, I will never leave you. And I'll always stay by your side and support you, dude, till I die. Or till death. I will remember you. Thanks, bro. I really appreciate you, man. Uh, I really do appreciate all the support you've given me individually. I don't get why doing face cam gameplay is a thing. I just said that. <laughs> to be more professional. The content and commentary is the only thing that we need. Stay true. You're my favorite Dokkan tuber. Uh, and feedback. I know it's hard, but just ignore stupid people. Man, I appreciate you, Tony. Thank you. Krillin it. Don't fuck with D-Free. Hey, enough said. I'm going to leave you a like, bro. Uh, Lotus Nerdcore. Thanks for all the comments you leave me, man. I appreciate it. It comes with the territory, a territory, homie. Uh, you just being a real nigga. <laughs> Doing you and letting these fuck boys. We really don't give a fuck if you don't agree. Uh, you're entitled to your opinion, but don't get disrespectful and expect a nigga to be silent. Nah, fuck all that. Exactly. Like, I get that people are entitled to opinions. They can say what they want. But if I flash back, right? If I flash back and, and I say some shit back to you, don't expect, like, you know, I think what it is is since they're behind the keyboard and I'm a YouTuber, it's like there's this whole dynamic. I don't know what it is, but there's this innate mindset that they think that they could say what they want to me and I will not say anything back. I'll just be like, oh, man, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry that you, you know, I offended you. I'm like, bro, fuck you. Get off my video. I don't care. Leave. Somebody was like, oh, you're mean. I'm unsubscribing. I said literally response back with see ya. Goodbye. I don't care. Get the fuck off my channel. I got no room for people like that. Um, you sh I'm just being honest. You know, I'm not trying to sound rude or whatever. I'm just being honest. Um, YouTube should add specific words or phrases that should be banned in a comment section. I'm sorry, these really, really long comments, I will check them out off camera. I know Scott left me a really long one because he always does, um, but I can't read it all here because I do have constraints. I was going to uh, – YouTube actually does have that. I just need to, you know, play with it a little more, no homo, um, and enable it and change around some of the stuff like that. 
Don't let them get to you, man. I appreciate you, Blank Page. And Scott, I'm going to skim you too because I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. My only advice would be to respond to the comments that are actual criticism. If they mention something about the video and not yourself, unless it's relevant in context of the video and then they are critiquing the video's quality. But if they mention something about you, then is an attempt to criticize you or insult in some regard, in, in, uh, intentional or not. I think you already covered that in your video. I just want to vent out the frustrations in the real world into the virtual community. Yeah, um, you know, just it's, it's all over the place, man. I, I do appreciate you and being one of my better friends on YouTube, even though we don't talk as much as we used to. You know, things have kind of, our channels have gone in different directions, and I do appreciate you, man. I really do. Shout out to Scotty specifically because he's one of the first people that I've known as far as being a YouTuber. Um, you know, he 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 uh does good content you know he's he's really underrated so go ahead and check him out scotty wolfrey um let's go ahead and sun jetsu you see modest we should collab on some videos i have a very small and new dragon ball channel I have some interesting video ideas let me know uh, this isn't really the video for that you know but i don't mind you know hit me up on like social media uh this is a great video you make some good points and you deserve respect Thanks, I believe. I appreciate you to the truth. Uh, Vegito, this very generic name. Uh, you have a right to your opinion, D-Free. Everyone does, and this is your channel. You run the show, not us. Thanks, bro. I appreciate it. Krillinit, a hey, hashtag Krillinit. And this video's comments as well. That's my thing. Eventually, it's going to turn into a t-shirt. I think you're doing fine with your routine currently. Whatever path you take uh, can have risk, but the choice is yours and how you make choices. You are who you are. Choose to be. Uh, yeah, he's touching on, like, me talking about maybe I'll take a hiatus or whatever the case is. I don't know. It, it's seeming possible. It's seeming likely, but we'll see. I don't know yet. Um, don't take this wrong. You have kids. Yes, I do have two. I have two younger kids, a son and a daughter, a six-year-old and a three-year-old. Um, I will always support you. I appreciate it. Just like my bitch when she asks for child support. I'm done. <laughs> to be honest, I don't understand why the kid thing is such a shock. I'm not a kid, man. I'm not a kid. I'm a little young to have kids. Don't get me wrong. It's just because I started early, as I said so in one of my videos the other day. I'm turning 23 on Tuesday, December 6th. But, like, you know, it is what it is. To be honest, I feel like you should just ignore those people and be the better person. If someone comes to your channel just to shit on you, it shows how pathetic they are. Uh, just don't acknowledge them and keep doing yourself. It's not really about that. I do understand what you're saying, but it's not really about that. It's not really about being the better person because more or less, I'm not going to let stuff go unsaid. I'm not a very combative person, but I'm not also, I'm also not going to be disrespected. That's the thing. I'm not going to be disrespected. I command respect and I respect, command respect from everybody. I don't care who you are. You know, I don't disrespect people blatantly out of nowhere. You will never catch me on somebody's comment section if I don't like their video saying, oh, fuck you, faggot. Da -da 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 -da. Your shit's garbage. You should kill yourself. I'm never like, bro, fuck all that. I don't care how old you are. If that's most likely internet trolls, kids, young people, whatever the case is, I will never do that. So, no, it's not really about that, but I do understand what you're saying, man. I appreciate the comment nonetheless. Um, uh, Michael. Uh, Chris, <laughs> Krillinit, don't fuck with D free. 41 likes. I'm actually one of them, too. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, everybody, in the comment thread, by the way. Damn, this is why I love you, D-Free. You're literally the realist. I try to be honest, man. I've adapted this honesty thing, man. And Geekdom goes a Geekdom is a really big proprietary, you know, force, driving force in me becoming this way. <laughs> Cause he's a really good person, a really cool friend of mine, and he helps me out a lot. And I come to him for stuff. And you know, when it comes to this, it's just it, it gets stressful, man. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, I get you, D-Free. I've been harassed for my opinion on Dogen cards. Some point <laughs> even by Zenrod himself people insulted me when I have a different opinion than them they have always been an accepting of me and troll me saying I'm a noob at Dokkan for whatever stay strong and the fan base is supporting you thank you I appreciate it as far as Zen I can't really comment on that I don't know what's been said or what's gone on I'm sure you guys are discussing it but I can't there's 40, 40 comments I can't uh Zen is a good friend of mine sorry if he criticizes you in some way I don't know <laughs> um <clears throat> I love how he can be so calm and gangster at the same <laughs> it's just my my voice, man. Like, I'm just, it's just how I am, bro. Like, I'm not even going to try to, you know, sugarcoat anything. Like I said in this video, I'm not going to get all high pitch inflection. I'm not going to fall out of my chair at some shit in Dokkan or, you know, I'm not going to be fake, bro. I'm not fake. I'm not. I'll get excited. I'll, you know, turn up the inflection. I'll be like, oh shit, like, I don't know what's going on. Like, I'll do that shit in the video. But, like, if you're talking to me, this is these type of videos, man, I'm just talking. This is me. On a personal level, this is the realest version of me possible. You know, I'm, there's no smoke and mirrors. There's no manipulation. It's just me talking, you know. That's the way I am. 
Uh, I subscribe because I love your personality and how real you are. Don't change that. Thanks, bro. I appreciate you, Muffin. Um, Sani Bali, you're dope, but what's with the thumbnail? Um, th there's no, there was honestly no general reason as to why I uploaded that thumbnail. I just, I was actually looking for an image of like Goku, like a sad Goku, and I was like, eh, whatever. Let's just see crying Dragon Ball. There's no reason though. It's not like I was sad or anything like that, but I did want to put up something that would be, you know, catchy, of course, like every other thumbnail, something that people would watch. Because I honestly didn't have high expectations for this video view wise. Eight eight thousand views is not my normal. Like a Dokkan video will get twenty thousand plus after like a week, but like that still blew my expectation that it got as many views as it did. Um, so yeah, there's that. You are you and no one else. Keep being you and believe in yourself uh, and behave like you, excuse me, because you're big. If people don't like it and people don't agree, well, you're just people we can agree. And the bigger you'll get, the more people will not understand that each of us are different, think different, act different. Keep doing what you're doing. Uh, I appreciate you, man. That's the realest thing I've seen so far, man. Real talk. Just be you. Thanks, man. Um, hi, anyone. Want to add each other on Dokkan? Really, bro? It's for real? Is that really the point of this video? Get the fuck off. Here come the trolls. Surprisingly, there haven't been any. So I'm, I'm happy about that. That guy literally just triggered me. He pissed me the fuck off. Get the fuck off the video. It's fucking just... I'm not even going to say anything more because it's not even his fault. But it's just like, this wasn't for that. Don't come to this video with that. That's not what this is for. You could have left that on any of my other Dokkan videos. That's not what this is for. Um, sorry if I sounded... Rude or whatever. That just kind of pissed me off. Though, I'm not going to lie. I truly hope you, uh, you see this comment from Giru. I, I'm, if someone wants to dissect your quotes for this example, poorly dissected, uh, or bash you, just ignore them. And I know that sounds unoriginal and passive and uh, as fuck. But most of these people are under 13 and have no logic to them. I've had many YouTube arguments on Dragon Ball videos that come with no maturity and no logic, like someone trying to argue with me that Broly busted the South Galaxy, even though <laughs> that's wrong as fuck. Turn on the guy uh, was under turned out the guy was under 13 and didn't know what dub errors were, but I most importantly wouldn't admit he was wrong and uh, wouldn't stop arguing. Ultimately, it's the same thing. Illogical people are just going to stay illogical on the misunderstandings they'll have. You know, I, I do I do agree. That's kind of like on the same thing earlier. But see, the thing about it is, I I don't care. It's more or less, as a parent, and as a parent that demands respect, I don't even look at it as like me being, you know, not the bigger person or me being immature or whatever you have or whatever have you, excuse me. It's more or less, if you're a kid, it's even more reason for me to grill you because you can't think that's cool. You can't grow up thinking that it's cool to be a fucking cyber bully. You can't grow up thinking that it's cool for you to say whatever you want behind the keyboard. That's not how this works. So it's even more important, if that's the way I look at it, for me to grill a kid, put them in their fucking place, and then have them learn from their mistakes and learn that they can't fucking get away with it. Because I make so many of these stupid people on my videos that comment negative stuff look dumb as hell. I make them look fucking stupid, and then they, fa they fucking just, oh, well, you're dumb anyway. I'm like, Bye, block, goodbye. I've said my point. You read it. You got my point. You made yourself look dumb as hell. Get off. So it's, it's more or less, I wouldn't want my kids doing that. I would not want my kids do that. I would fucking beat my kids' ass. Excuse me if there's a lot of profanity here. Um, but I would. You know, it's just, it's just honestly what it is. I'm not like that. I don't want that type of atmosphere around my channel. I'm going to have to wrap it up here soon. I don't have a lot of time left. Um, you're not arrogant. <laughs> I'm sure I sounded arrogant in this video. Lord Frieza can be a little arrogant, <laughs> but he's a cool guy, uh, at least from the outside looking in. I haven't had a chance to look to talk to him. So, uh, no one can change your uh, what you want to do. You have kids. Yes, we talked about that. Curling it, curling it, curling it. Thanks. Or get ducked up <laughs> or fucked up. Excuse me. You could have just edited the initial one. Ooh, girl, I, su I support you 300%. Thanks, bro, Michael. I appreciate it. Hashtag curling it. Thank you, John. Yo, D3, the funny thing about YouTube, there be these people saying, you're so dumb, kid, but the sad part is they're probably like 12, and let's say, and you're like, let's say 16, 17, or 18. It's so sad. Yeah, that's true. People say that to me. I don't know what it is. It's like I've got a young voice, and I'm, you know, the thing is, I'm black. I'm 6'3". I work out every day. I'm fucking like 230. I have two kids. 
I am the furthest thing from a kid you can fucking see. But thing, the thing is that my voice is misleading, right? I sound like I'm white, right? I sound like I'm younger, right? It's, it's not the truth, man. I grew up in a choir. I grew up singing from 11 years old. And when you grow up singing like that, and you grow up singing on the higher notes, like tenor and stuff like that, and alto and all that stuff, I'm not going to get into the logistics of all of the different you know, tones you could sing at. But like, what it is is your voice adapts and it doesn't, mature the same way it would have generally it comes down to the vocal cord elongating and stuff like that but for me personally i can still hit a lot of those same 10 or 1 notes that i could um not as clear not as clear you know as much clarity but i can still hit a lot of those stuff that stuff and you know so that's pretty much why so it's like my voice didn't mature so getting back to the point they look at me like, bro, you're a kid because you sound like a kid. And especially when I throw on the inflection and they get really high pitched and stuff like that. And I just get really like all over the place. Like, oh, man, like, no, that's not. No, 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 no. I'm not a kid, bro. I'm a grown ass man. <laughs> I'm a grown ass man, bro. I have kids. I'm not a kid. So it takes a long time to get that through to people. Um, either people are going to follow you and listen and watch your videos or they won't. Don't even let the shit affect you. I try not to let it affect me. I do genuinely try not to, but it is frustrating. I can't lie. And I could, I'm sure every YouTuber can say that. Don't validate yourself with people. You are you, man. Good luck. Thanks. I appreciate it. Coben, hey, sorry I'm late. Congrats on 30K. I appreciate you. We're moving on to 35. Hashtag road to 40K in the comments if you made it to this point because I do want to genuinely hit 40K. Um, stay yourself, bro. These are going to be the last few. I love your videos. I appreciate you, man. Don't be a kiss ass. Just be yourself from King Tacho. You're my favorite Dokkan YouTuber because you keep it real and you just speak your mind. If you think a card sucks, you say it. If you think a card is great, you say it. I think it's pretty much agreed upon in the Dokkan community that Super Saiyan Blue is not that good of a card, or at least the hype around him was unwarranted, which is 100% true, but you can't, people won't understand that concept because they'll look at Vegito's potential damage, and I'm like, I don't want potential damage. Even with the dupe system, he has a potential fourth attack. They all can be super attacks and counters. And oh my god, you can get him to super attack 10. This fucker will do like 3 million damage in one turn. He'll get four supers and like six freaking counters. That sounds so appealing, doesn't it? Until you realize your chances that that shit are like fucking like 1% of you know, that exact sequence. So like, there's no point. And then obviously 1% is just a number I threw out there, but still you get the point. Um, Rose Black and the others in hand are crazy consistent and it's probably the single best card in the game right now. Anyone who wants to disagree with the facts can just fuck off. Yeah, um, Rose and Vegito are the best two cards in the game. And Kaioken Blue Goku is like a top seven unit. So it's like that's why AGL is still king of the game because you have three top ten units there. And, you know, there's not anything you can do about that. Um, so AGL, even above heroes and villains, I'd say, just generally. Be yourself and don't give a fuck. Do whatever you want. Yeah, I will. Clearly, this video shows. Lit. Thanks for the double comment, Chris. Um, totally understand your point. Last comment from Gabby. Um, even if sometimes I don't... Is this a chick? I think I've seen a chick here. Like, I don't know if I've got chicks in here because, you know, they don't comment or they don't have their names or whatever the case is. If you're a female, leave a comment down below. So I need to know who you women are so I can stand out. Or you, so you can stand out, you know, get priority. Women first. Uh, anyways, uh, even if sometimes I don't en uh, enjoy stuff you say or take it the wrong way or anything, I will always hit the like button because I know you work hard for us. I say thanks because what you celebrate or you create, excuse me, by the way, keep being you. That's why you're growing for entertaining and being real. Thanks. And so I, I appreciate the realness there, too. It's like you don't agree with me sometimes. That's fine. Like everybody doesn't have to agree with everybody else. I'm, I'm, my word isn't, you know, my word isn't, you know. The, the end of the story say say all be all it's not i have opinions too a lot of what i say can be factual it can be factual but it can still be an opinion like for example me saying blue vegeto because that's one of the things i got criticized a lot for because people didn't understand what i was saying apparently me saying he's inconsistent is factual but you know it's still an opinion at the same time even though it's factual i'm not gonna inflection on that one but you know, it is what it is, man. Um, thank you once again for everybody else that commented on this video. I genuinely appreciate it. I do. You guys mean the fucking world to me. Uh, you really do. And um, I don't really have much else to say here, man. We're just going to keep on going. And I don't know what's going to happen. But I'm glad you guys are here with me. So hashtag Cronit. Let me know if you made it to the end of the video. I appreciate you. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.